Hey beauties, um, I'm coming back at you um, with an unboxing. So um, I just ordered new hair from Wow African for a new install because I think I cannot use this hair. I need to take a break from the one on my head. If you want to know my honest um, opinion about this Indian virgin straight hair on my head from Wow African, please check out my um, two month update and my two week update um, that I'll have up for you. Um, but now I'm gonna go into my newest purchase from them. Um, it's, uh, I did another one of their uh, bundle deals where you get four bundles, but this time I went with the Peruvian hair. So, ah, same, <laughs> I don't know why I did that. Um, came via FedEx in like three-ish days. Um, and the typical Wow African box. And same as last time, um, the like little sheet thing that has like various hair gurus from YouTube on it and return stuff and hair care tips. So yeah, anyways, don't swim in the sea, okay. Anyways, so I got the four bundle deal from the Peruvian virgin hair. It basically, I got the lengths um, 14, 16, and two 18s. Um, I think I just wanna go longer. Um, 16 inches is great, but I think with the bangs looks, I think I still wanna stick with this type of um, like fringy, like bang look. Um, I want the hair to be a little bit longer. I think that'll help balance it so it's just not so big in this like middle area. So um, I'll show you, they each come individually packed. Um, part with the shortest. So, ooh, this is what it looks like, 14 inches. Um, run my finger through it. Doesn't really have too strong of a smell. It has a like, you know, a very mild um, factory scent. Like, it smells clean. So I don't know, maybe it's what they use to wash it, but I'm gonna wash it again before I install it. Um, these, this is what it looks like, the tracks and the beards aren't too long. You can kind of see them sticking out here. So that's the 14 inch, it looks great. Great movement. The hair I got in the natural color and it's definitely leaning more towards a two, but I won't have any leave out, so I won't have to worry about blending because my hair is more of like a 1B. So that's the 14. Now this is the 16. Again, great. My fingers can run through it. Yeah, it doesn't really have a strong scent. I won't say it has like no scent, but it's not strong. I think it's just whatever they use to wash the hair because it doesn't smell like corn chips or anything. It's not a bad smell. Um, and again, this is what it looks like, the tracks and the beards. You can see these ones, like the beards I think are, look a little shorter and the other one. I don't like my beards too short because sometimes it can be like a little itchy, but, um, and they can get matted, you know? But, so we'll see. And again, this is that same, like it's a more of like a two, even though it's a natural color, it looks really um, kind of light, like a one B, between a one B and a two. Um, there, no gray hairs or anything. So that's nice. And it doesn't have, um, I remember last time, I don't know if you watched my last video, I hate when there's like, sometimes you'll see like this weird, like almost like coppery bronze, weird reddish color hairs in um, like virgin hair. And I'm like, nobody's hair is that color naturally. And those hairs get on my nerves because they usually just like look really weird and fake. Um, this doesn't have that. So I'm hoping that this is like real good hair. Um, and you can see, the ends like 
they're, it's pretty blunt, I'd say. Like, it's not too thin. So that's great that it's mostly true to length. It's what we like. <laughs> um, ooh, how do I get this back? And now the two 18s. And I got two 18s just because I wanted to make sure that the length, with the length was thick enough. Um, and I'll probably layer it, but I just really wanted to make sure I had that length. I feel like sometimes one bundle of the longest isn't enough. It looks too thin. Um, so this is the 18. Um, I think it was like bent in the bag, so it has that like wave pattern to it. But we'll see what it's like when it's wet when I wash it. Um, these are the track. And then again, you can kind of see the beards on the side. These ones also have really short beards, too. These ones are really short. Um, this one doesn't, yeah, no smell really. Like not a strong smell. Same smell as the other ones. And you can see the ends are all right. They're like pretty thick. Um, this has a split end in it, though, so I'm going to have to cut that. So, yeah, these ends on this one are not as, um, like, they, these are look a little bit dry. I'm going to be honest. Uh, it's a tad dry. There's a couple split ends in here. So, there's that. But overall, it's like, I can, it's not really going to take off that much length. Um, this does have that weird bronzy hair in it, though. It has one. So... Hopefully this isn't going to be a bundle that's going to give me grief like my 16 inch that I have in my head right now from their Indian hairline that uh, is like the bane of my existence. So that's that. And then this, and this is the last um, 18 inch bundle. Again, and like I don't know if I showed up close, each bag is individual, each bundle is individually wrapped and it says like the length it has like all the details of the hair on there if you can see and this one was kind of bent so it's probably gonna be a weird shape and yeah so this is this one Let's see yeah no smell run my hands through it easily great and this one, the ends are a lot thicker. This bundle's um, 18 inches is better than the last. I'd say the ends don't look really, they don't look dry. They're a little bit more full. And there's no split ends in this one, so that's nice. Um, color's great. No grays, no weird colors. You can see um, the tracks. And this one also has some short beards as well. Um, so... We'll see how this goes. It definitely feels um, not, uh, it doesn't feel like court, like as coarse as this. But the Indian was pretty smooth when I first got it. But um, this, I think, feels a little less, like, thick, if that makes sense. This feels a little bit more, like it's not as, like, thick um, or dense um, as, like, the Indian hair felt. But I'm fine with that, so... I do have four bundles, so I think that should be enough hair um, to get the look I need. Um, but yeah, it smells great. So I'll definitely keep you guys um, updated um, when I get it installed. I'll do another like two-week update and another two-month update. I might do another in between, maybe one month. But so far, so good. I mean, one thing I do really have to commend while African is that they definitely do really fast shipping. Like, you can get your stuff in three days, and then it's shipping from China. So they definitely do a really good job with that. Um, the hair looks great when it's the way they package it individually. Um, but the test really is, is I don't care about packaging and all that stuff. In the end of the day, I really want good quality, and I'd be willing to wait an extra week or two for my hair if it meant that... I was getting the best quality so and for the price and they have really good price so I think sometimes you have to just like you it's almost like you get what you pay for except I've spent a lot of money on virgin hair and got
crap to you so if they send you the bad batch so i'm hoping that this is really good it says that proven hair is like good hair on their website that it's like one of the higher qualities uh, i think their highest quality is their european hair um so um i'm looking forward to trying this um I really hope it goes well. I'll keep you guys updated. Um, if you have any questions in particular about the process um, of getting this hair, um, any questions at all regarding my experience with Wow Africans so far, um, just leave it in the comment section below. And I'm gonna put the details of this hair in the description bar and a link. Um, yeah, and I think that's it. So yeah, I look forward to seeing you guys in the next video and hearing from you if you have any questions all right so i hope you guys have a great day and i'll see you next time beauties bye